Are you a fan of home and family? If you're in the Los Angeles area and would like to be a part of our audience, send us an email at hnfaudience at gmail.com. Audience members must be 12 years of age and older, and groups of up to four people are welcome. We'd love to see you here in our home. Well, today, today, Miss America 2015, Kira uh, Kazans Kazansive, like Kazansive. expansive. Ex I said it so like well during the this morning. Is, yeah. Yeah. Well, well, you are back yeah, joining us, so it's good to have you back again. Okay. Thank you for having me. So you have a very serious platform. Tell everybody what it is. So my platform is called Love Shouldn't Hurt, Protecting Women Against Domestic Violence, and I've teamed up with an organization in New York called Safe Horizon. They're the mm -hmm. largest provider of services for domestic violence victims in the country, and we've started this campaign called Put the Nail in It. Yes. Mm -hmm. So what we're doing is encouraging people to paint their left ring fingernail purple, and that shows your vow to end domestic violence and put the nail in it for good. But you know what? You have a personal connection to this, so right. you don't just sign up for this I and do. not have a have something that really pulls at you. Sure, yeah. Share a little bit with us. So when I when I was set, told that you have to pick a platform, you have to yeah. pick a cause that you care about, I said, you know what, I'm going to talk about something that I'm personally connected to, and this is something that affected my life for about two years, and I made that decision when I began competing in Miss America that this is going to be what I would talk about, and I had no idea the... Um, impact that it would make and how incredible it would be for in my life to to give back in this way and to talk about domestic violence on sure. the national level. Was there pushback? Pardon? Was it pushback? Oh, at absolutely, all? absolutely. I mean, people, did people be like, why is she talking about this? People poke and prod and yeah. um, ask really inappropriate questions and make really mean comments because they don't they can't understand, they don't want to understand. And it, you know what? Um, I'll take as many of those comments as possible. That way, that we can have all the conversations. And we the can. doors flying open. Or are you still pushing to get the oh, the doors open on domestic violence and and its awareness? You know, I think everybody can agree that this is a cause that we need to fight, That's and this yeah. is something that we need to raise as much awareness on as possible. So, um, the media has mostly been very welcoming to talk about put the nail in it to talk about yeah. domestic violence as a cause because um, if we don't, then we're contributing to the problem. Yeah. Well, you were recently honored at the 20th Annual Champion Awards, benefiting mm -hmm. Safe Horizons, which you spoke about in New York City and we actually have a clip of you of your speech part of it let's take a look a lot of times when people ask why doesn't she just leave it's very hard when they're being so sweet and you love them so much and you would do anything to have that moment of happiness back and at the same time he's sending you very vulgar awful threatening messages and and he's being so kind it messes with your mind. It turns you into someone that is unrecognizable. So every single time someone says, well, why doesn't she just leave? She's stupid. I think to myself, you have no idea the situation that that woman is in. You cannot understand what abuse does to a person and their mindset. So as Miss America, I get to talk about this on a national level and be a part of the national conversation Good for I, you. I know that this Good was, you. you went there last year and you were hosting a booth at the time for. I was uh, there as a local title yes, holder yeah. hosting the social media booth. And, and this year I was there as Miss America being honored. And you were able to use your voice mm -hmm. to, to yeah, talk so about that. Yeah, it's incredible uh, what the difference a year can make yes. in your life. Yeah. And, and it's uh, a difference when you actually stand behind your courage yes. and your bravery and say, yes. this is me. I may not be proud of everything that's happened, mm -hmm. but if it helps serve others, absolutely, I applaud that. Absolutely, thank you. I know the organization does a lot with Children's Miracle Network and yes. Children's Hospital. Yes, Children's Miracle Network Hospitals. I serve as their National Goodwill Ambassador mm -hmm. and I travel all across the country visiting many of their 170 member hospitals. And in fact, I'll be at Children's Hospital Orange County tomorrow morning right. uh, while I'm here in Southern California. So um, it, is, it is just the most incredible job that I get to have as being Miss America. And I've met some of the most wonderful little kiddos. I know, I know yeah. you're very close to a very special little boy. Yes. Who is he? Uh, little Nate from Florida. Uh, I think we spoke about him a little bit last time yeah. I was right. here. but he. Since then, he sent me some very adorable videos, but um, he's just um, a light, and he inspires me to be a better person every single day. Well, so take a look at this. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hello, Miss Kate Kazansev. I've been thinking about about you lately, and and um, I want Mom to send you a video to 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 saying hi, and I miss you, and I like your pictures on Instagram. Bye.
Oh. Oh, sweet. And so he says cute. your name so much better oh, than Oh, he I. does. <laughs> Nate can say my name, and he likes all my pictures on Instagram. I'm sure he does. How <laughs> oh, cute is that? You also, we have a lot, we have so much in common. You went on the USO tour, <laughs> I which did. I did, and it was one of the best things I have ever done in my yes. life for our service men and women. Mm -hmm. Your experience, do you share that same viewpoint? I mean, it was one of the most incredible things I've ever done, not just as Miss America, but my life. Um, I mean, that's we're right. yeah, that's our, that. that's our tour yeah. group there. Um, and we were with uh, the Vice Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, Admiral Winnefeld and the USO, and Dennis Haysbert, and Andrew Luck, and Philip Phillips, and Coach Pugano, and uh, a ton of other people. Wee Man, oh my, me, me and Wee Man are like the odd couple. Wee <laughs> He's so funny, I adore him. Uh, girl, yeah. But we just had the most incredible time traveling, and we traveled about uh, 25,400 miles in six days and 17 Can I, I want to oh. point out, please keep this picture up, because when, when for those at home who don't know what the, much about the USO tour, mm -hmm. and maybe you shared this, when I was there and we traveled to Kosovo and all whatnot, when you see the look on the servicemen and women who have been away from their families for so long and mm -hmm. they see someone like you show up, mm -hmm. it means so much to them that it's almost a hand reaching out to saying, hey, we know you're here and we care mm -hmm. for all that you do and you sacrifice for us. And I see a group of shot like that and it's just, it, I'm so proud of what our servicemen and women do for us and what the sacrifices yeah. they make. Well, it's important to understand that we would not be on this show right now if it weren't for all those people in that photo. So yeah. they, they create those opportunities for us and um, they kept on saying, thank you, thank you for being here. You know, we, we needed this little piece of home and for me, I just, I couldn't believe that they were thanking right? me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it, it just, it, it blows your mind how incredible they are and how committed they are to providing the freedoms that we sometimes take for granted. Yeah. Uh, and that just puts into perspective how, um, how important it is to support our servicemen and women. Yeah. You do the crown justice. Oh, thank yes, you. You really do. You're <laughs> doing such time. a wonderful yeah. job. You. And keep, I know yeah. you're getting to, what do you have left? A couple of months? I have just under four months left. Four months. So we're getting, we're winding down. We're I getting know. to the end. And soon a, a new young lady will get this amazing opportunity. So. Will you come back? Thank you. Yes, come oh, please. back before. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah, moving to LA, so I'm going to need a job. Okay, <laughs> great. Okay, okay. Come back Excellent. Yes, come back and see us. Yeah. Well, more information, you can go to put the nail in it. Dot com. There right, they are, yeah, right they there. Are. I'm going to get a darker purple next time, though. No. Uh, when we come back, though, uh, you're not going anywhere because we're going to test your knowledge. Yeah. Okay. We're going to yes. do a little beauty pageant version of Heads Up. Heads up.